Well, yeah, real quick story. This is Paul from Vaughn's Restaurant and Grill. But, Paul, uh, when I moved here seven, eight years ago, of course, after a year or so, I met who is now my wife, Katie. And so that was the best thing that ever happened. The next best thing was she introduced me to crab claws. And from then on, it was my favorite golf dish <laughs> ever. And so I was so excited because I don't think we've made crab claws on Studio 10 before. You're the first one, buddy. Thank you. Thank Truly you. original. So tell us a little bit about uh, Vaughn's Restaurant and Grill. Well, what makes us so unique, Joe, mm -hmm. is that we have such a diverse menu. We have American, Asian seafood, from po' boys to platters to shrimp parmesans to crawfish and shrimp fettuccines mm -hmm. to uh, hibachi grill. Uh, and, and another great thing is we are diverse, but we also have a chalkboard mm -hmm. that's in the front of our restaurant to keep people guessing. We always have one or two items that we never repeat. Awesome. So you always have something to look forward to, not the same old regular menu you go to most places. So that's a little something that we throw in extra. Yeah, and you guys may kind of be, I know you're not really a secret anymore, but, but I'm going to say the best kept secret on the Gulf Coast because your food yeah. is amazing. And I've heard people talk about Vons when I've been out and about. Like you have to go down to the bayou and right. try out some Vons seafood right. and grill. So speaking of seafood, we are making the crab claws. What's the first step to get started today? Well, uh, the first step we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and make us uh, a dredge. Start off with some good farm fresh eggs. Okay. Okay. Uh, from that point, we want to go with about two for this amount of claws. We're going to do about a pound of claws today. All right. And uh, I get my claws from Dana Seafood in Bayou La Battery, a good friend of mine, number one in crab. I mean, absolutely superb. That is So awesome. keep her in mind as well. All right. uh, after we do two eggs, we're going to put a little bit of buttermilk. I say a cup and a half, two cups. Okay. And we're just going to kind of whisk that together. Mm-hmm. Okay, real quick. Just want to get a good mix. Uh, from there, this is going to be a dredge. I like to use buttermilk and fresh eggs. It helps it bind to the product and also gives them a nice, rich element of flavor. Yeah. Okay, so we got that there. Now, we're going to go ahead and take our flour. This is self-rising. I find it sticks better to the, the uh, product itself as well. Okay. Versus all-purpose flour, which is great for baking. Um, now that we have that there, I got a little bit of in-house seasoning. I have a little bit of Old Bay garlic, black pepper, a few other things in there. Few, uh, yes. wait, wait, wait a minute. <laughs> few other things. Is, is that the secret right yeah, there? The few yeah, other things? yeah, yeah. All right. So we've, we've got a little little secret recipe over there, but Absolutely. you can add, you know, Absolutely. whatever you want: garlic powder, onion powder, that kind of Absolutely. stuff. Absolutely. So we're gonna get that mixed together very well. And what we do is, is we would dip in the dredge first, mm -hmm. and then we'd move to the flour. All right. So we'll do that a little bit in the next segment, and we'll also talk more about Vaughn's Restaurant. I know you guys want to tell uh, the people all about your catering and things like that, so Absolutely. we'll tell them about that in segment number two. And in segment number three, I'll be back, and I'm just going to sit here the whole time and eat crab claws. It's going <laughs> to be awesome. Sounds What's good. <laughs> Golf crab claws. I'm Park Creek, and they did not let me know about the big celebration this weekend. Not cool. Hey, but this is cool. Just talking to Paul from Vons over the break, you just got engaged. Congratulations. I did. Thank you very much. So we have to bring that out. Always <laughs> love some good news here on Studio 10. And this is good for you guys, giving you the recipe for Vons' famous crab claws. Actually, jumbo fried crab claws here this morning. So earlier, you were talking with Joe, and you gave the recipe for the batter. So what's right. next? Okay, uh, the steps for cooking is we're going to take our fresh crab claws, we're going to put them in our dredge that we previously made, all right. From that point, we're going to take them, we're going to get a little bit of the excess off so the uh, flour doesn't get clumpy, Okay. and then we put it in there, give it a little toss, all right. okay, same thing here, last two. All right, now, what we're going to do, we're going to let this bind together. Doesn't take much, and we're just going to transfer these over here into the plate. This is a messy process. It is. It really <laughs> is, but it's well worth it. Yeah. Well worth it. Crab claws are so good. Yes. And if you want to go get the crab claws at Vaughn's Restaurant and Grill, you can go down or by La Battery, right off Winslow Avenue and by La Battery. You guys are locally owned. You are open Monday through Friday and also on Sunday. You're closed on Saturday, and that's because you guys do a lot of catering. Absolutely, we do. We actually do on-site catering. We have reserved parties, and we seat up to 100 people, and we do off-site premises as well. We've done a 200-party wedding, a 100-party wedding. We love to do churches. Uh, just give us a call. Our phone number is 251 824 
1444. Any questions that you have, please call myself. Vaughn will be there. We can speak to you and uh, answer any questions that you may have. And we'll make it easy for you. We'll put that phone number in case you didn't jot it down on fox10tv.com. On our Studio 10 page, we're going to put these crab claws in the fryer. And I think I should probably step back, okay. don't you? Okay, please do. <laughs> you probably should too. Okay. There's an art. So just let it get in there and be careful. And those don't have to fry very long. You go maybe a minute, minute and a half, and you'll be good to go. And that's uh, low to medium um, heat? If you, if you can get a digital, you want to be at about 350 degrees. Okay. okay. So you can get a digital thermometer, stick it in the oil, and it'll allow you to understand exactly what your temperature is, and you can assume where you need to go from there. Oh, man, they smell so good. You can taste it. Absolutely. And, in fact, Joe is going to taste these crab claws in just a few minutes here on Studio 10. Don't mind me. Crab claws in my teeth, all up in my mouth. Going to have a lot more. Fantastic job. Here's a look at the finished product. Let's take a look at that. For the folks just tuning in, tell us how you went through the process to make these crab claws this morning. Um, well, what we did, we number one, like I always say, it's got you got to have a great product. All right, mm -hmm. so we got fresh, locally picked uh, Gulf crab claws. We and take that's the most important thing. Most important fresh, thing, low, especially with crab claws. You know when a crab claw is not fresh because you bite into it and most of it sticks to the. Uh, bone and plate and yeah, stuff. And yeah, that's not good. Uh, but as you can see, our claws are actually very large. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, anyway, so what we do is we make a nice dredge uh, with our farm fresh eggs. Uh, buttermilk, like I said, it gives it a nice rich element of flavor. We take that, we move to the self-rising flour, the seasoning. Like like Chair said, you can do this at home. Uh, mix together, give it a good shuffle, get your, get your grease about... 350. 350 mm -hmm. is always a good choice. Cook it. Don't walk away from them. They cook fast. Mm -hmm. uh, put them over napkin. Get the grease out so it's a nice, good flavor. And then, you know, maybe you might want to take a little bit of uh, lemon, squeeze a little bit on top, a little cocktail and tartar, and there you go. All right. Well, I'm going to have another one, so you got to keep talking. Tell us more about uh, Vaughn's Restaurant and Grill. And one important thing to mention again is you're not open for business on Saturdays because Saturday is kind of the day you guys do catering. So if you're watching this right now and you're like, let's go tomorrow, don't. Try to go tonight, right? Absolutely. And I tell you what, guys, uh, today we have a, a great opportunity for you to enjoy a homemade crab au gratin. It comes with a side of cheese grits. Let me tell you, it is out of this world. Uh, so come in today. Like, again, Again, our number is 251-824-1444. Again, check our website out. It's V-O-N-S, Vons Restaurant and Grill. Everything spelled out. Give us a call, guys. Come see us. Uh, we're open. We have superb service, great food, and we'd love to have you. So thank you very much. Yeah, and your wife was here last time, too, and she makes some fantastic Asian cuisine as well. You yes. guys have such an eclectic mix of things at Vons Restaurant and Grill. So go check it out. I guess I'll have one more. And again, everything is made in-house at our restaurant. All right. Time for Cherish. And Cherish, you can keep talking because I'm going to keep eating. <laughs>